you know, I'm just trying to get my scenery and the, you know, my video set up here. And this darn chipmunk here jumps up right on the seat onto the coffee can. You know, I think he knows what's in that coffee can, little turkey. But what I want to sh shoot the the video is, and I'll get into focus here. Last week, Melissa. I don't want to scare the chipmunk too. Little chipmunk here. So Melissa, I, I was hand feeding these chickadees, and Melissa posted a picture on uh, Facebook, and you know, my family really reacted. And what I didn't know is. My Aunt Susie, who passed away, you know, years and years ago, probably 30 years, she loved chickadees. So my cousin reacted like, I think that was, you know, Aunt Susie coming to visit you. And, you know, and then other stories kind of came up that, uh, you know, my, my nanny, who's my grandma, who passed a long time ago, loved chickadees. And, uh, gee whiz, I got a, I got a chipmunk here at my feet. I don't know. Want some, bud? That's the crazy thing. Up here, these animals. Good, bud. You know, we all come up. And nothing scared. But, what the, I got an amazing gift last night, and, uh, This is a little uh, chickadee stuffed animal. And my kids gave this to my nana, you know, years ago. And, uh, you know, they love playing with this little chickadee stuffed animal. My, you know, my kids are all grown. And uh, so uh, my youngest, Emma, uh, you know, gave me that last night. Sorry, it's emotional. But uh, just thought that was so, so cool, you know, to. You know, all this comes about, it's like, you know, I've never, you know, fed a, you know, chicken or a wild bird by hand, and then you come up here. Sometimes I'll, I'll wiggle my thumb like this. And they always come and just grab, like, one piece. Look at, I don't know if you can see if I'm down by my feet, but I got this darn chip. Him away. You got a butt. Here, bud. Here. He's a little skittish. But uh, yeah, I came up here not to hunt, just to work on trails and uh, trying to get a, a trail through a swamp, which uh, probably just collect some rocks and uh, logs. And I think my neighbor, he's up here. So probably won't be doing much chainsawing, but uh, might be one of the last times up here with uh, with some decent weather. It is only 40 degrees, but come on, guys. Hopefully this weekend we have some. Uh, I want to get some Canada Jays. I've seen one, and they they're really a tame bird so I can I wonder if this camera is picking up this chipmunk that is now on my feet every time I get kind of too close he runs but here bud just crazy is, you know, I'd love to feed these birds all winter, but 
the uh, sure the heck I'm, I'm not gonna drive three hours to do it so we have some friends up here maybe I could uh, leave a can of sunflower seeds up for them and uh, make some kind of deal with them for them to come up What's crazy too, like in the city, you know, I feed birds constantly. All the birds know me, but there, you, no way would they come and uh, you know land on your hand. Well, what I'll do is I'll just uh, fill this up, and uh, gosh, by this this little uh, chipmunk, I. Never met him personally, but uh, he's he's awfully friendly. Here, probably I got some peanuts and walnuts in the house. I think he'd probably really really like those. But hey, uh, thanks for tuning in. If you haven't subscribed, please do, and make it a great day.